Oh, six very delicious thick vegan smoothie bowls, perfect for breakfast without banana. None has banana, get out of here. All under $2, that's what I'm gonna be making for y'all today, so stay right here, baby. Jesus, Woo. Hello, dudes. Today I'm super excited to share six vegan, thick, and refreshing smoothie bowl recipes without banana. By the way, they are all under $2 per serving, and you can make them in maximum two minutes, which is perfect for meal prep. So now let's jump in. The first smoothie bowl is a melon strawberry smoothie. Add one and a half cups of frozen melon with one cup of frozen strawberry into your blender. Blend them all in together for 30 seconds to one minute and you are done. And remember frozen ingredients and just a splash of liquid if needed is the key to get a very thick smoothie bowl. Transfer the smoothie into a bowl. I garnished it with melon little balls, brownie, and a little bit of pumpkin seed, but feel free to use anything you want and make it your own smoothie bowl. Finally, give it a try and enjoy the great taste. The cost for this smoothie is about $1.08. The second smoothie is a berry lemonade smoothie. Oh my God. Who wants lemonade? Me. Add one and a half cups of frozen strawberry, one cup frozen raspberry, and a splash of coconut water, two to three coconut milk ice cubes, and a juice of a fresh lemon in your blender. Turn on your blender for about one minute and you are done. Transfer the smoothie into a bowl. I garnish this one with a few kiwi slices, crunchy cornflakes, and a few pistachio. This one tastes incredible, just like lemonade, but better. The cost for this smoothie is about $1.27, which is pretty good. The third smoothie is a smoothie for coffee lovers. Oh. Add one cup frozen zucchini, one cup frozen cauliflower, one cup plant-based yogurt. I use coconut yogurt, by the way and one tablespoon instant coffee or a shot of espresso. Blend them all in together in your blender till it become a thick smoothie and you are done. Transfer the smoothie into a bowl. I garnish this one with a few mango little balls, chocolate granola and a few sunflower seeds. This one tastes like coffee and cauliflower, which is great in my opinion. The cost for this smoothie is about $1.39. Number four is pineapple smoothie. Very simple, but very delicious. Add two cups of frozen pineapple, a few leaves of spinach, one cup coconut yogurt, and two to three coconut milk ice cubes into your blender. Blend them all in for 30 seconds to one minute, and you are done. Transfer the smoothie into a bowl. I garnished it with a few strawberry slices, some granola, and coconut shreds. This one tastes like pineapple, obviously, and you cannot even taste the spinach. The cost for this smoothie comes out about $1.53, so cheap. The fifth smoothie is the peach dragon fruit smoothie. Oh! I've got one and a half cups of frozen peach, one cup frozen dragon fruit, and about half a cup of coconut water. Let your blender do the job till it become a thick smoothie and you are done! Transfer the smoothie into a bowl. I garnish this one with a few slices of peaches, crushed Oreo cookies, and some peanuts. This one tastes like so peachy and great. The cost for this smoothie is about $1.23. The last but not least is a tropical smoothie which tastes and looks incredible. Add one cup of frozen mango, one cup of frozen pineapple, and half cup of frozen papaya. I also use a splash of coconut water to make it a lot easier for blending. Blend them all together for a minute and you are done. Transfer the smoothie into a bowl. I garnish it with a few beautiful raspberries, some coconut flakes, and a few pecans. Guys, this one tastes super good, which was my most favorite one. The cost for this smoothie is about $1.43. And that's it for today. Guys, please take a moment and subscribe to my channel right now by simply clicking on my picture and check out my other videos right here. Thank you so much for watching and see y'all next time.